Hey guys, I'm Mark. And this is Mike. Hey, look, Mike's actually on a Let's Play. No! <laughs> and we're going to be playing Cruisin' USA on the Wii Virtual Console. I do have an actual N64, but unfortunately I don't have two controllers, nor do I have the cartridge for this. So, we're playing it on the Wii. And uh, this is a game Mike and I actually really like. Mike really likes racing games. Hell yeah! I really like arcade style racing games. And this kind of uh, tickles our itch for both of us, so to speak, would you say? I wouldn't have used those words, but sure. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta make it amusing, though. Yeah, you know. Alright, let's look at the options. What do we got? No, no controls. Well, no, I just want to look at the options. Fair enough. Mm, split le- ooh. Ooh, okay, so we can split our sound. I'm going to combine that so it's not annoying for headphone users. Uh, difficulty, that's fine. Well, let's turn it up. You sure? Yeah. We kind of sucked before. No, you <laughs> sucked. <laughs> I. <laughs> okay, fair enough, but you didn't have to. Yes. Metric off, controller setup. Okay, return to game. I think we're good. All right. Game pack, that's fine. We'll just pretend there's a game pack in. Sure. So let's see. Should we? Uh, Iowa. Let's let's cruise the USA. All right. Oh, you gotta press start. Oh, I do. Start. Third player challenge. So, um, I actually have a classic controller. Mike is using a Wave Bird that I bought on OfferUp for a pretty good deal, actually. Uh, oh, wait, 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 wait. What did I do? Okay, yeah, no, I, think, oh, I, think um, I, I think I clicked automatic. I'm going to go with not manual for right now. All right, what card are we on? Oh, man, do they have an El... Do they, Ferrari! Do, do they have an El Camino? No. Oh, I want to drive an El Camino. Fine, I'll be the piece of crap. All right. <laughs> I'm guessing the triggers are go? No, it's going to be A, most likely. Oh, okay, find out. Because remember, this is an N64. Yeah, game. it is. No, A is A in switches fact, view. A is in fact switch view. Okay, what triggers are definitely go? Um, oh yeah, okay. It's, it's the other trigger. Oh, I see. It would be what Z is normally. That that makes a lot of sense actually. Ooh, look at that. We're playing. Did you switch the music track? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> First person. Yeah. So, Mike, have you actually played the arcade cabinet of this? A long ass time ago. They have it in this pizza place up at the summer camp where I work. Oh, nice. To work. And it was great because they actually had it networked together so you can play. Oh, player. sick. I don't think they have it there anymore, though, unfortunately. They used to have one of them, too. Yeah, oh, well, let's be careful. I'll have to censor that later. Fair enough. <laughs> we don't want to reveal too much about That's where we true. are. That's true. So, uh, at the bowling alley is what he meant to say. Yeah, that. But, the um, steering is touchy. Holy crap, I forgot how touchy. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Get wrecked, nerd! But yeah, this game's great. This is one of the... Checkpoint! I, I think this was one of the launch titles for the N64, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, what the hell is... Oh. I, I bumped you. Yeah, you did. Uh, but yeah, the arcade cabinet of this game is fantastic. If you can get your hands on it, I highly recommend it. Of course, not everybody's going to have space for an arcade cabinet. I don't have space for an arcade cabinet. Yet. Yet. Fair enough. But, uh, yeah, if you can't, then the N64 Racing lines up! Is Shit. Get out of my face, purple! <laughs> <laughs> the N64 version is more than serviceable. In fact, I I kind of like the N64 version a little better because... Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> You know, I, I like how you can do the split screen, which you can't in the arcade version. Yes. But I wish the N64 had better network ability so you could do, like, each person do a console. But that wasn't really a thing until the next generation. Oh, I mean, son of a bitch! <laughs> I mean, you could connect two PS1s through serial. That's right, serial. Serial. Yeah, imagine, Super serial, guys! Imagine trying to play a network game across serial connections. Imagine how awful that must have been. Whoa. Like, can you even imagine that, Mike? No. Because cereal's so Stop slow. distracting me! Oh, wow. I got fourth place. I got last. I told you we should have had it be simpler. No. Oh, but I got a new hot time. Yeah, you did. My time is hot. I hadn't crashed 17 times. It's okay. We're, we're figuring it out again. Yeah, we are. Oh, I get to enter my initials. Yeah, Seven. Girl. 
That's a seven. Yes, yeah, seven. No. I gotta. I got. I gotta do me proud. I gotta do. Um. I forgot how the alphabet worked for a minute. Yeah, boy. Merc. You got merc. I got merc. I thought about doing ass, but that was oh. too obvious. Yeah, it was. Hey, look, it's O. Daw. Does that say SJW? No, SJK. <laughs> okay. Oh, there's a W below it. Dr. Oh. W. Push start. Alright, next race. Here we go. So, Mike, you're... You're an aficionado for racing games. Is yeah. That, is that fair to say? Mostly. So... Do you think this measures up to some of the other racing games you've played? Uh, measures up? It's difficult to compare because it's an arcade game. But in terms of arcade racing, absolutely. It's one of my favorites. Get out of my way! Oh, that's you? Yes! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> you're right, but at the same time, I kind of am. Um, but yeah, certainly for its time and for what it is and was... Definitely yeah. love it. So, so let me ask you this: You know that other arcade racing game we found, Driving Dirty or something like that? Oh yeah, Dirty Driving. Uh, do you think this measures up to that? Um, no, they're not comparable because this is pure racing and Dirty Driving. Ow! Oh my God! You just <laughs> freaking pinned me into that car. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that is true. Dirty Driving is. It's more a it's a battle racing game. It's yeah. more like um Arctic Thunder. Yeah, it's it's more like a Mario Karty. Yeah, Mario Karty. <laughs> <laughs> well, I had to turn Mario Kart into an adjective. Fair that enough. Was, uh, that's the easiest way to do it. Haha, <laughs> screw you. I really like this piece of craft car I'm driving. It looks, yeah, oh my god. It looks camera. ugly, but the handle Get is out of my face. awesome. And it, gets, and it gets to... Are you trying to pit me or something? <laughs> no, I'm trying not to ram into your ass. Oh, Signs. I keep, love those constructive barricades. You keep moving in front of me. I know, racing. Oh! <laughs> Shit. So, shout out to SGI for helping Nintendo make the N64. Like, for real. Thank you, guys. Um, Silicon Graphics, whatever's left of you. Thank you. I don't think any of them are ever going to hear that, but, you know, I figured you may as well. Because you helped to make one of the defining consoles in my childhood. Mike was mostly a PC gamer, right? Uh, I was PS2 until I'm fire truck until I was PC gamer. <laughs> well, yeah, but even back then you had stuff like uh, Monster Truck Madness 2. Yeah. yeah, that's a good one right there. Oh, I got a trophy. Yeah, you did. You won. Cause you freaking psyched me out of that car. <laughs> <laughs> so what's funny? You saw the girl giving me the trophy. She's actually censored in this release. Ha! In the original, she has like a skimpy tank top thing. Nice. So, yeah, the N64 version censored her, which is hilarious. Oh! 41. Yeah, boy! Number 41. My longest <laughs> yeah, boy ever, dot .mp3. I've been saying that way too much lately. Yeah, you have. <laughs> oh, you don't get a start in first? No, you always get back to last place somehow. Oh, I peeled out. I like this do? bit of lag at the beginning. Yeah. The slowdown is real. I don't know if that's bluegrass boogie. I don't know if that's entirely emulation's fault or if that's something that happened in the purple on the fricker. Cartridge. Get out of my way! Ha! <laughs> because honestly, I've never played the actual N64 cartridge of this. I have played it on the Virtual Console on the Wii, and I played the arcade. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I building. I didn't. Oh wow, that was cool. I didn't know anybody who had the N64 cartridge back in the day. Oh. Uh, Oh. oh! Okay, so yeah, but what did you have before the PS2? Uh, that was it. I had a Game Boy Color and then the PS2. Oh, a batch to spin me out! Ah, I'm batch. That car is a batch file. Dot <laughs> BAT. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, the Game Boy Color is a good starter. Yeah, it was. Hi, I just spun him out! When are we gonna do the, uh, the front light mods? Oh Mike yeah! Because that's still a do thing. that, yeah. Mike and I like to mod our stuff. Well, mostly me. But yeah. And then I drag Mike into Pretty it. Pretty much. Because I'm like, Mike, I need help. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever I'm too stupid to do, I call Mike for help. <laughs> yeah, like bring a 25 foot patch cable. Okay, to be fair, that was Henry's thing, though, not mine. Right. And I could have made it work if you didn't have one, because I have 
like four switches that I could have interlinked with four different <laughs> sized cables. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh. <laughs> the switches <laughs> across the hallway. It would have been, but it would have worked. So I was, oh, building. Freaking tunnel walls, man. Dude, the tunnel wall like bounced me really weird. Yeah, it does. So I was like, I really hope Mike has a long enough internet cable. Ha! And wouldn't you know? Ah, car! And wouldn't you know you did? Ow! Dude, you're gonna make us both lose! <laughs> <laughs> so Mike and I just helped my brother film something for his class. Yeah, suck it! Nice! We helped him film something from his class on Battlefront 2. Uh, he's making a machinima project type thing. Maybe we'll upload it on the channel later. I don't know. Depends. Oh, I gotta enter a hot time! Yeah, you do. A hot time. <laughs> <laughs> I get to enter a hot time. So push A when you when you find a letter. So um, but yeah. So we played a lot of PS2. Bob. Bob. A lot of PS2 Battlefront 2, which if you guys are yeah! regulars on the channel, you might know Henry and I are playing Battlefront 2 on Xbox. So why not use the Xbox version? Well, because Henry doesn't have an Xbox in his room, but he has a PS2, so that's why. Alright, push start. Oh, well I have to push it? Oh, yeah, I do. Yeah. Because I entered the time. Yeah, boy. Ready? So yeah, Mike, um... Uh, I used to find out. No, I didn't. Uh, okay, there we go. Um, I'm gonna crash. No, I'm not. Nonsense. Your car accelerates faster than mine, but mine has a higher top speed. Yeah, but mine's easier to handle, easier to control. Yeah, it is. This car is way too touchy. Smack. That and I find mine doesn't spin out as much when I hit things. Like that? Yeah. <laughs> it takes like a significant. Your car's probably heavier. Holy, get out of my way, purple! <laughs> There's a big pile of <laughs> Yeah, there, there it is. <laughs> oh, and then a pink car hit me and spun out. Whoa! Yeah! Dude, I got some sweet air. Yeah, you did. And it... Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> get wrecked, nerd! <laughs> oh, that sucks. Oh, the train. Oh, car! Oh, it... Oh, it's yeah! The train. <laughs> the the train, I think it? it might be. Yes! Oh, car! Son oh. of a... Mike and I played this before, and he, what, what was it? You rammed into the train? At top no, speed? I beat the train, and the train clipped me as I crossed the track. <laughs> <laughs> and so it completely glitched out the train and just blocked the entire railroad crossing because it wrecked the train. Oh yeah. no, I almost didn't make it. Oh, check that out, boy. This is not okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's not okay. Get away from me. I think it's pretty okay. Well, yeah, you don't have a dude on your ass. That is true. I, I, you know, I think I'd be very shocked oh. if there was a dude on my ass right now, considering I'm laying on well, it. Well, guess what? I'm on your ass. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, yeah! Ha-ha! <laughs> First. I thought you were going to ram into that truck. Oh, that was dirt. That dirt was bad. I tried to cut the corner too much. I noticed. Because <laughs> all of a sudden you just dropped off and I'm like, where'd Mike go? Yep. In the dirt. Mike, this isn't dirty driving. No, it's not. It's cruising USA. We're not cruising, we're racing, boy. The game's called Cruising USA. I don't care, we're racing. There's also another one called Cruising World, which I, I think is pretty good from what I hear. It's basically this. No! More exotic locations. Crap. I'm going to get third now. Uh, no, this is not the train level. I haven't, I haven't actually played Cruising World, but I hear it's pretty good. We should, uh, we should look at getting that for the actual N64. You know? Yeah. Oh, now I get the new hot time. Yeah, you do. No, it's a hot lap. Right, we don't need to watch the whole. Animation. No, no, we don't. We know what's happening here. Ready? Tease it, tease it. Yeah, boy. How special. This looks pretty good for being in an N64 game. Tubular Surf. Like, the N64 is actually pretty impressive. 
Oh, this is the forest level. I hate this level. Yeah, the trees render in so poorly. Yeah. That, and you actually have to use brakes. Nonsense. I will not use brakes. Ah! I refuse to use brakes. No! <laughs> That's what you get for not using brakes. Oh! How did I hit you <laughs> straight out? That is bullshit! <laughs> It's because you were traveling fast and I was at like a standstill. That doesn't. Oh, well, how does he hit me? I used one. To bullshit! <laughs> bullshit! It's because your car's a lightweight, I guess. Yeah, I guess. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> uh, that was horse shit. <laughs> the highest caliber. And I'll tell you what's horse shit Joey Wheeler dueling. He's all luck. No, he's dog shit. He, he's all luck. Fair enough. Oh my god. I'm in seventh because of your stupid ass. It's not my fault you ran into me. I just flattened a redwood. This car is not light. It just flattened a redwood. But these, but Mike, these aren't actually redwoods. These are paper cutouts of redwoods. Fair enough. Oh man. Oh man. <laughs> yeah, I remember this level being a pain in the ass. Yeah. Oh, stop spinning me out, yellow. What the hell? Oh, I just flattened another one. I feel like six is a mile ahead of me right now. Oh my god, no! No! Come back! Oh, this level sucks, but yeah, luckily once you're out of the forest, it looks weird. It looks weird. Yeah, look at the palm tree. Oh stuff. yeah! Pink, get that pink here. car just passed me. You're not that. Holy crap! I'm glad there are no cars in the forest. No traffic, rather. Yeah, really. That would be horrible. College boys in faggy white shoes. Yeah. Those college boys always wear them faggy looking white shoes. Uh, it was great. I told Henry that the other day, and he was like, what? Because apparently they don't have to read that anymore oh, in English. Oh, boo! That's what I said. Boo! And Mike, will you enlighten our viewers on what book we're referencing? A Raisin in the Sun. Yep. So... Before you guys get mad at us, uh, read some classic literature. Yeah, classic American <laughs> literature. <laughs> get out of my face, purple! Blue, please, no! Oh, I'm gonna make it! I'm gonna make it! Yes, How we don't have to redo it! <laughs> How did you get to first? You were like in seventh. <laughs> because I got to a straight shot and I just zoomed ahead of everybody. Nice. And then... The guy next to me ran into a fire good. truck, which spun. Oh, good! Hit me, slowed so me down. So you basically won because you're Joey Wheeler. Pretty much. Go good. This car is the Joey Wheeler mobile. Yeah, it is. Joey Wheels. Joey Wheels. I'm gonna call it Joey Wheels. All right, Joey Wheels, let's do this. Beverly Hills. I stopped singing that. That's where. No, we can't sing because we don't get any copyright struck. Yeah, I know. That's why I stopped. Yeah, you dumbass. <laughs> you dumbass. <laughs> Would Mike Judge copyright strike us for that? No, he, no. he didn't copyright strike a little crazy. Yeah! No. Purple, please. Yeah, that guy's being a dildo. Oh my god, Purple ran me off the road. Okay, so how come your car could flatten Redwoods, but, but it can't flatten... But it can't flatten a palm tree? Get out of my... I'm pretty sure palm trees are a heck of a lot weaker than Redwoods. Yeah, they are. You can rip them apart with your hands. That, that's not an exaggeration either. Yeah. Like, palm trees really are that weak. Like, there's a ton of them by where we live. Yep. So, uh... And the stupid palm fronds get in the road all the time. Yeah, they do. You get caught under your car. So I literally did that. I haven't done a little palm tree. I've done that with yucca trees, though. Oh, man, that's fun. Literally. Where'd you come from? <laughs> Behind? No shit, Sherlock. <laughs> <laughs> My top speed's pretty good. Yeah, it is. Mine's better, though. This car in general is pretty good. Yeah, I, it I is. Really like it. I'm gonna pick this car every time I play now. Oh! Oh, no! <laughs> uh, I hit the P2 no! car. Get out of my face, purple! Oh! No! Yes! Okay, that was a checkpoint. Ah, uh, yeah, now that lines! Oh! That P2 car hit me. Yeah, it did. Oh, what the heck? Oh no, I'm in the grass. Get out of the grass. You're a car, not a rabbit. 
tunnel a screw with my face. <laughs> Mike, did you see that? No. As I was entering the tunnel, there was a uh, a fire truck coming out of it, and it clipped on part of the oh, tunnel and spun. That. Oh, get this car. <laughs> hey, Mike. Thanks. I got car. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you sound a little like Gavin there. I did. <laughs> but yeah, no, as I was entering the tunnel, there was a fire truck coming out of it. And it clipped on part of the on, on part of the tunnel oh, no. and spun around. Oh no. Oh speaking of spinning around. To give you an idea of what the AI is like in this game. Oh but the, all these I just got screwed by three cars not blind quarters! That is bullshit! You need to use your mirrors, Mike. You know what? <laughs> Invent a mirror that lets me see around the blind corner in front of me and I'll damn use it. Welcome to the <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Have you seen the proposition that somebody came up with where it's like, um... The freeway. Where it's like, uh... Cars are equipped with, uh... Like television screens, basically that have cameras no. all over the place, and you use the cameras to drive instead of a windshield. That's horrible. I agree. I definitely agree. And I'm like, why would anybody come up with that? The one advantage you could have is you could see what's ahead of you, but then. How but you know what? That's what a windshield is for. Yeah. Exactly. Except then glass wouldn't go all over you if it broke. Um, what do you think the screens are made out of? That is also true. Ah! I watched that happen. I was trying to pass you. <laughs> you got a little too greedy there. Yeah, Matt. I did. Oh! 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 How is it the guy who's bigger into racing games isn't beating me? Because <laughs> he chose a crap car. <laughs> and you know what? So I like him. Generally good at him, but... Oh! I like some racing games. I like more arcadey ones. See, that's why. Ah! That car was not there. Yeah, I, I, I much prefer. A... How did you not get ahead of me when I crashed there? Uh, because I crashed into some light poles. Oh, good. Yeah, I I, I tend to like arcadey yeah, ones better. Yeah, I am. Better. I am way fast. You in a flat out straight. And I think you, you don't you tend to go for more simulation. Yes, games? like Need for Speed and Dirt. Oh, Dirt's an awesome game. Dirt is pretty cool, actually. Yeah, Dirt three. Oh, oh. Yeah, I, I like my uh, I like my arcade style games, especially arcade racing. For some reason, it's really fun. Yeah. Oh. But I also like Mario Kart -y games where you get to throw items and stuff. At people. Yeah, like dirty driving, and you need to play Arctic Thunder. Isn't that the uh, the water one? It's not snowmobiles. Snowmobiles. Yeah, it's awesome. And they have like a they have a balloon battle style mode too. It's awesome. What's that on? Uh, it was on PS2 when I played. It's also on cabinet. Ooh. Nice uh, way to ride the bank there, buddy. Yeah, I don't know why I <laughs> I did too, but I did it better. I'm gonna beat you because you screwed up. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. As long as one of us gets it. That's true. We've been one two almost every except for the forest. Yeah, the forest, I zoomed ahead and got and the first, first one. Well, it made us redo the first one, yeah, because we were kind of just learning the controls. Yeah, we did. Dang, we'd be getting a lot of free plays if this was the arcade cabinet. Yeah. I wonder if it's also on Xbox. If it was on the arcade cabinet, we wouldn't be playing on the second easy difficulty. That's true. We are the hardest. Um, but Mike. But what? Do you think Arctic Thunder's on Xbox? Uh, probably. Because if it is, I'm gonna get that version. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Nice. Laker pile up. Oh, <laughs> Laker. Ha, <laughs> purple and gold. <laughs> that dude just tried to pit me and it backfired spectacularly. <laughs> so did that guy. <laughs> Two AIs just tried to pit me and they screwed themselves. Lol, bye, Red. Lol, Lol. bye, Mark. Pink. It's not pink. It's lightest red. Okay. <laughs> yeah, there's a name for that. It's called pink. <laughs> uh, glorious. Is this the railroad? This might be the train level. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> oh, you <laughs> shunted me out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I get ahead of people. 
I just, like fucking him up the ass? <laughs> I just gently nudge you from behind. Look, courtesy like reach around, they're like, whoa! <laughs> <laughs> uh, can I have blues on your ass? Oh, blues ahead of you. Yeah, he's ahead of me now. Well, that can't stay. Oh! oh. Alright, I, I, I'll avenge you! I saw that coming too, and I was trying to avoid it, but I didn't turn as much as I thought. Oh, okay, that one blindsided me. <laughs> yeah. It's okay, I'm gonna avenge you! Hup! Do it. I just gotta catch him. For glory, Mike. For glory. For guts and glory! Oh. And, cause Blue's a piece of shit. <laughs> Pretty much. I think in this race, blue represents our uh, innate dislike for cheating AI. Blue represents my innate dislike for blue. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, you were you were a a team red guy, weren't you? Um, no, I like blue. I just meant this blue right here. Well, no, I meant like. Uh, oh, but generally, yeah. Yes! Ah, so I punted him off to the side of the road! I saw that. <laughs> You're welcome. I, I watched that. Uh, ah! Somebody! <laughs> no! Oh no! no! <laughs> no! It's working <laughs> up too! <laughs> oh, come on, get back here! It's okay! Oh, oh not no! again! No! I'm not not again! Yes! Yes! No! <laughs> oh, go! Oh, no! you got lucky yes! there. Yes! No! Yo! Yeah! <laughs> no! 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 Get Thank him! you, Blue! Yes! <laughs> Thank you, Blue! Oh, the train! No! I see the train! The train! <laughs> Alright, I'm out speeding the train. Yes! Oh, I'm gonna catch the train! I'm not gonna catch the train! I was ahead of it. Oh, Please. Blue got screwed up! Oh. <laughs> oh, that was amazing. Okay, so that was the train level. Damn! Oh, that was awesome. <laughs> Blue, what a piece of shit. <laughs> it's weird, this is called Cruising USA, but we're mostly on the west coast so far. Well, yeah, we're in the desert now. I didn't think there were this many courses. Well, now you know. In our Arizona. I wonder how long... I wonder if we're just racing across Route 66 or something. No. Speaking of which... It's hard too far north for that. That's true. Speaking of which, sometime, Mike, I want to drive the entirety of Route 66. Yes. I think that would be awesome. Most of it's I-40 now, anyway. You just go and see all of the neat little towns all over the place. Yeah. Oh! Yeah! Mike! <laughs> why you do that? <laughs> because you are in my way. Hey, the, hey, this yellow car behind me has like a little tramp stamp on it. Yeah, it does. Can you still call it that if it's on a car? Yes. Hey, are, are we playing cars? No. There is actually. A yeah, I know. That what's her name? The hotel owner, the freaking cozy cone motel lady. She has a tramp stamp. Yeah, she does. And it turns on Lightning McQueen. That's funny. I was gonna say though. Oh no. I was. <laughs> Did you see the police yes. officer cause that? Yes. I'll get out of my face, blue you bastard. Oh, but I was gonna say there is actually a Cars video game. Oh, is there? Yeah, there's like a movie game of cars. I see it on the PSN all the time. And it's horrible. It's always on sale, too. Of course, it's shovelware. I'm tempted to buy it just to see what it's like. But I don't have any... Oh! But I don't have an HD capture card yet. We're still recording through composites. Da, 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 da. Oh. So maybe someday I'll get a uh, HD capture card. No! But, uh, so you know how Henry has a Wii U? Yeah. He wants to record Wii U stuff, but he doesn't want to have to get an HD capture card. So, what's he gonna do? Uh, so he wants to get composite cables for it, and I'm like, that's a shame, knocking it down to composite, because it looks... Because the Wii U is genuinely gorgeous. Yeah, it is. Graphics. Yeah, it is. And Maybe, he's... like, low polygon, but still good-looking low polygon. Oh, it's beautiful. Well, it's not even really low polygon, it's that's like... That's true. The Wii like... was, but the Wii U is better. The Wii U is like equivalent to the 360. So not during first. I got screwed back to fifth. Or oh no! Oh, you're not in first anymore. I'm in second. It's okay. I can take it back. But um, take it back. Yes. But uh, uh, I forget where I was going with this. Oh yeah, but anyways. So Henry and I got to talking about. Oh, I'm in second. I wonder if it'll let us continue or if we have to do it over. Again. I don't know. Let's find out. Oh, you got a new time. Yeah, I did. Nope. Welcome to the Hall of 
But, um, continue, yes. Oh. Okay, so it's gonna make us do it again. Yeah. Okay. So, anyways, um, I was talking to Henry, and he's like, did you know they actually make official RF cables for the Wii U? Nice. And I'm like, RF? Really? So, basically, you can get the worst possible video quality out of a brand new console. <laughs> because... Because apparently Nintendo's concerned people still have TVs that only have RF inputs. In the year 2017, there might be one person out there holding off on their 1980s tube TV that only has RF inputs. Yeah. Well, I mean, to be fair, um, I do have a 1980s TV, but it at least has composite. Yeah. And that's not the TV we're playing on, by the way. Because as you notice, this episode... Oh, screw you, Blue! <laughs> I just took out that semi and took me into him. <laughs> Another Blue, like, clipped into my corner and it made him spin out. <sighs> yeah, that's nice. I love that. They try to pit you and they end up pitting themselves. It's kind of hilarious. Uh, that's wait, that means there's a Blue in second and a Blue in fourth now. There was a third, but he wasn't. Third. So there's, like, a light Blue and a dark Blue. Yeah, there is. But They're yeah, both Blue. They're both the, uh, shit. But the uh, oh, that's a mare. But the 1980s TV I have, the uh, Mike, Mike knows the one I'm talking about. That's like a, a big cabinet TV. Yeah, that's it is. Awesome. Yeah, it is. Speaking of which, did you notice my new end table, Mike? No. Yeah, it's what my laptop is sitting on right now. Oh, I can't see it from here. It's it's like dark wood. Oh, neat. And it's uh, hexagonal. I think. Hexagonal. <laughs> it's either hexagonal or octagonal in shape. Okay, first of all, it's octagonal. Whatever. I'm not a math professor. I don't care. I'm not either, and I do. Well, I don't. <laughs> I know, and I do, so I'm going to correct you. <laughs> okay. Fair enough. No, you're supposed to disagree with me! Okay. <laughs> no. <laughs> I, I, I don't care enough to disagree. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> My apathy levels are off the chart. But, but you cared enough to chart them. That's that's the most clever retort to that I've ever heard. <laughs> I'm gonna use that sometime. For some reason, I will use that. Did you win this time? Yeah, I did. Good. So we don't have to redo that one. Good. Uh, now where are we? Arizona point two. So yeah. Grand Canyon. Yeah. Okay. Close enough. So Mike. Uh, is there anything you want to tell the viewers about games you might be playing in the future? Um, Homestar Runner. Okay. That was uh, Mike on the games he plans to play for the channel in the future. And Magicka. Oh, Magicka. That's... I'm going to get Kevin on that one. We're going to finally beat that thing and then possibly the sequel. That's going to be a good one. Yeah, it is. I can pretty much just watch your guys' Let's Play and then know how to get all the achievements. <laughs> yeah. Well, not all of them. There's some that we skip. That makes sense. Magicka has the best side quests out of any game, though. I'm not going to spoil it, but it has the best side quests ever. It was pretty cool when I played it for a little bit. Yeah. Oh! Cop car! I was too busy watching Blue and didn't see that cop. <laughs> I blame you. It's all your fault. Stupid Blue. Yeah. Man, this road looks familiar. Yeah, it's the Grand Canyon. I've never driven in the Grand Canyon before. This is nothing like the Grand Canyon, first of all, because you wouldn't drive down the middle of the canyon. No? They don't have a road down there? No, because it's a river. Oh, that first makes of all. sense. <laughs> See, I, I've never been to the Grand Canyon. I don't know. I haven't either. About it. Probably the road looks familiar because it's an old game with very few resources available to it. No, I meant like it looks familiar as in I've been. Ah! As in, like in real life, Freaking... I've been on a road like this. I just this. killed somebody in the back of that ambulance. Rip them. Oh! Crap. Dirt. But yeah, no, I swear I've been on a road like this one in real life. With like similar scenery. Um, probably driving frickin' to the desert. That's what this reminds me of, especially with the windmills. Yeah. This reminds me. No, this reminds me of the way to Las Vegas. That's what this reminds me of. I know you're right. It does, it, it does feel like that. If you guys don't know, there's like one road you can take to Las Vegas. One. Yeah, it's called the I-15. Look at a map. It's um, 
It's just a huge stretch of road with nothing for miles and miles, except for a prison in a few places. I and guess. a town with the world's biggest thermometer. Yeah. And Peggy Sue's. <laughs> I've never been to. Pe I always see the sign, but I never. Yeah, I never. There. I wanted to stop Peggy Sue. Oh balls! He messed me up and made me lose. I lost the game. Ah. Uh, <laughs> we're gonna have tons of hate comments. <laughs> yeah, we are. That. Oh wow! Look how far we skipped in the USA. But that's uh, not I where the Grand Canyon is. <laughs> what the hell, Gabe? <laughs> <laughs> well, is is the map actually called Grand Canyon? Yes. Look. See? What? <laughs> so it's called Grand Canyon, but it takes place way north of it. Way north and east? It takes place in freaking South Dakota. What the heck? Well, there's I'm nothing grand about South Dakota, nor are there any canyons. I'm trying to think. <laughs> <laughs> That's just mean to South Dakota. All 12 people who live there, sure. <laughs> But Mike, what a, you're going to be terrified the day that North and South Dakota settle their differences and become one big Dakota. Oh no! It's a whole lot of nothing. They go from being two little bits of nothing to one whole lot of nothing. <laughs> I'm super scared. What are they going to do? But nothing Mike, the but, rest of the United States to death? But Mike, the, the rest of the... Well, Mike, when they combine, their population is going to like double to 12 oh, people. Yeah, I was going to say, oh no, it's two dozen people now. <laughs> uh, where are those blue car rubber bands? Oh, they, they have to. Yeah. There's no way they can make an AI good enough otherwise. Especially not in these early days. That's my biggest complaint about Need for Speed Hot Pursuit 2. With the li with the uh, limited memory. Because yes. the N64, stock N64, only has 4 megs of RAM. Yeah, it does. And a 16. Dude, something. you're getting bod and he's failing miserably at bodying you. It's funny to watch. And like a... Ha <laughs> ha, he just screwed himself up. <laughs> But yeah, like oh, the, the, I, the N64, I, as much of, as it was a technical powerhouse in its day, is pretty weak. Well, yeah, it was what 18 years ago now. Well, I mean, even for the time, it wasn't. Like, That's true, you know. Because I mean, compare this to the arcade version, and there's like, you see how how it calls constantly as we go ahead of us. Yeah, it doesn't do that at all in the arcade. No. Version. You know, I'd be beating you if I didn't keep tagging the dirt. What does that car swerved? Well, you also picked a car with worse handling. No, it's too touchy. That's the problem is it's too touchy, so I end up tagging the dirt. But I guess that makes it worse. I, I would say it does. Yeah. Some people might disagree, but... Let's say it's it certainly more precise, but it's just too touchy. Yeah. It's all or nothing. Which is If the game didn't have binary steering inputs, it'd be much better. Well, this was an N64. I know. I was saying, in a newer game, this type of handle would be great. I'd love it. Um. Hold on, it's not binary. It used the analog stick. Well, I mean, it's still all or nothing. Mm, that's I, true. I have very little control. I either turn or I don't. That is true. They pro Well, it was the early days of analog. They were probably. Oh, that's cool! You can see my car steer in the. the Victory screen. What? Yeah, look, look, look. Oh, I can do it too. Yeah. <laughs> That's I never knew about that. Yeah. Now, now we're in Wisconsin or something. Iowa. Iowa. I was close. Oh, hey, shout out to uh, uh, Slipknot. Yeah, there you go. Shout <laughs> out to Slipknot. Because <laughs> we are in your home state. So I was talking. Uh, uh, oh, you know what it was? When we lost the Grand Canyon the first time. It showed Iowa because that was the next track. Oh, that makes so yeah. much more sense. Yeah, doesn't it? I rammed through a stop sign. Yeah, you did. Toll booth. Flying they, they, toll they debris. Wanted, they wanted to inspect my cheese. No, that's Wisconsin. Well, yeah, they wanted to make sure I wasn't illegally importing Wisconsin cheese. Illegally importing cheese. Well, hey, if they have the produce check plants all over California, why can't Yeah, but that's cheese? for Mexican stuff. Yeah, that's true. It's in the United States, it's American. Oh! <laughs> well, I mean, they also check you from... It's okay, I took out blue for you. Thank you're you. welcome. But they also check if you're coming in from Nevada. That's true. Huh! Oh. I, I think it's because they don't Corn. want you to have, like, parasites and stuff. Because a lot of California's, uh, 
economics is actually it's agriculture. Yeah, it is. Um, which, which a lot of what? people don't know. I just like spun out into that car and then into you and it like canceled. Would you stop that? <laughs> you also flattened a uh, utility pole. Yeah, I did. Apparently it's made of redwood. <laughs> so Mike, did I did, did I tell you about the time I was uh, I was going to work and then I got like on the way to work I got a phone call and my boss is like, okay. oh! My boss is like, yeah, you don't have to come in today. I got somebody else to come in for you. Oh, I think... No, it wasn't you who told me about that. I was thinking of someone else who did that. And I was like, oh, okay. And while I'm talking on the phone to him in my car, uh, a guy, like, swore. Oh, yeah, you control. told me about that. We were going to see Kenneth and you told me that story because it was in the same spot it happened. Yeah. That's my car was having that weird-ass noise shit. Oh, my God, 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 God. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I remember that. That's right. Yeah, you're... That, that was so weird. It happened like one time. Yeah, it's like because some car. I don't know. Well, I lost. Yeah, I. Whatever that was, it was bizarre. Well, blue so far back that didn't even catch me. That's good. So we should be fine. Yeah. Also. After... Yeah, you were on the phone with your boss, and it's like this dude just spun out and crashed, and then and I was like, he was like, "Don't call the insurance." I'm like. You're like too late. Yeah, I, I'm like, oh yeah, I already called the cops. And it's like, fuck, I don't have a license. And then he ran for it. <laughs> it's just booked. Does that make that technically a hit and run? Technically, yeah, it does. Because uh, oh, and now we're in Missouri. Ooh, we're in misery. <laughs> like we're both doing the car thing, the scary thing now. <laughs> well, now that we know about it, maybe yeah. as well. No reason not to. Yeah. But yeah, no, that is technically a hit and run. Yeah. So if they catch that guy, he is... Oh, Chicago. This is not Chicago. No. Arlington, maybe. So if they catch that guy, he's fucked. Yeah. Because that, that's technically a hit and run. Not only is it a hit and run, but it's a hit and run of a public utility. Yeah. Which is even worse. That. So, yeah, if, if he gets caught, he's fucked. Um, but the people who were there and, like saw it happen because it was like right in front of their house yeah uh they were saying yeah he's got to be an immigrant or something why do the cars keep ramping is there ramps in the road uh no i think you're hitting like signs and stuff. oh because they're hitting the signs ramping how <laughs> your arrow just loaded in but um yeah I think, oh what a turn i think uh, like what they were saying is he's probably uh, an indian immigrant oh yeah you're telling me about that huh because, I mean, to be fair, his accent was thick. His accent was... Did you call the cops? Did you call the cops? I don't have insurance. Yeah, his, his accent... Oh, was... His, his, his accent was thicker than butter. If that analogy makes sense. Sure. Let's go with that. Yeah. I, I was going to say something else, but I figured it would be too rude to say on the channel. So I didn't. I was going to ask you what you were going to say, which would defeat the purpose of you not saying it. <laughs> <laughs> I, th I think a lot of people can infer what I was going to say. <laughs> Who's in first? You. Oh, blue. Fuck you, blue. Get back here, you piece of shit. Primary color, you piece of shit. Stop driving on the roads! <laughs> Where are they supposed to drive? The ceiling? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Man, that... That fire truck messed you yeah, up. Yeah, I'm still in third though. Hey, wait a minute. Is this Spider-Man's town? Chicago? No. Well, because it has like the train thing from the movie when he had to stop it. Remember uh, that? Oh, is I mean that is the L, but I don't remember the movie. Uh, Spider-Man Two when uh, Doc Ock like that may have been in Chicago. Cause I'm trying to think if any other town has the L like that. Because. Because like I remember, oh speaking of the L oh hey, I passed whoever passed me before oh good um but yeah I remember in the movie it's supposed to take place in New York but they had this thing and like the train was going and Doc Ock's like yeah I, I made it so it can't stop and so it's gonna into the ocean so uh, bye bye oh. first place good that L that fire truck screwed me so hard oh it did. <laughs> that was ridiculous that was, oh. <laughs> Look at all these stars. I know. I love how, like, there's nothing from Arizona to Iowa. Well, like, I know, Wyoming, right? Colorado, just don't exist. Like, almost... Utah, Nevada, freaking New Mexico, no. Almost all of the... It's funny because it's called Cruising USA, but, like, almost all of the things yeah. are on the West Coast. Right. Now we're in Indiana. 
Hey, my, my hope is still That's where I was born. Don't look too deep into that. Away we go. Zoom, zoom, motherfucker. This game was brought to you by Samuel L. Jackson. <laughs> Freaking turnpikes. Whoa. And that flat map. Well, you can tell this game is old because if it was representing modern day Indiana, they would have roundabouts everywhere. And potholes. <laughs> yeah, and potholes. <laughs> it's weird because, like, some parts of the road there are beautiful and pristine, but they have fucking roundabouts every three feet. <laughs> and then other parts of the that road. That car are, was like, camouflaged. Jacked up. Amazingly jacked up. Like, some places on the Indiana Road were worse than San Bernardino. In terms of the road. Because, I mean, Mike knows what I'm talking about. Yeah. The road there is awful. Yeah, it is. It's so bad. How am I in second? I've crashed like four times. Because everybody else is crashing more than you, I guess. Apparently. It's pretty pathetic. Oh, oh, get off the dirt! Mike, this isn't dirt three. I know. Uh, you know what? You know what game I need to get? What racing game I need to get? What's that? Uh, freaking ATV Off-Road Fury. Oh, I have ATV Off-Road Fury two for the PS2. We should bring it. Yes, you should. That game is awesome. Yes. I love ATV. Off -Road yes. Fury. Awesome. I want to get. Uh, I want to get whichever one interconnects with my PSP game. Because I, I have a PSP game of one of them. And, oh, that was interesting. I spun out that cop car, but all it did was push me back. Good. But, um, the interconnectivity is basically I can share custom maps between the two versions. It's so, like I can make a custom map on the PSP and then port it to the PS2 version, and vice versa, which is awesome. I love interconnectivity like that. You know what's really a shame, though? What? Neither the PS2 nor the PS3 really took advantage of the PSP's interconnectivity stuff. No, they didn't. It kind of just was a wasted feature. And I mean, the Vita tried to take advantage of it better. We're going to finish in the Capitol. Oh, we're going to wait to the Capitol building at the end. The Probably. Hopefully it doesn't blow up on us. Like in uh, that one movie. What? Fourth of July? I don't know what the movie is. <laughs> it was Independence Day. Okay. <laughs> I thought I was making that joke. I, you, you should know I have... No, we're in Appalachia right now. Well, I know, so we're going to finish in D.C. I was looking at the map. Oh, that's true. But yeah, I, you, Mike, you should know I haven't seen many movies. Yeah. But I figured you would have gotten the, the joke, 4th of July Independence Day. Well, if, if, I, if I was more familiar with it, I probably would have. But mm. I've seen... I mean, pretty much any movie of Washington D.C. Features, features a bit of blowing up of a government building. Would you stop that? Oh, my God. Both got screwed, bro. Yeah, we did. Also, Mike, did I tell you I was watching something the other day? Um, I was watching this, uh, this Chinese cartoon called Fate. Oh, is that like the game? No. I just spun out over that jump. No, no, no. It's, it's, it's not like the RPG Fate. It's like... Um, it's too bad that doesn't have multiplayer. We need you Torchlight. Yeah, we need you Torchlight at some point. But, um... It was, uh, it's, it's basically like people summon magic servants and make them fight for the <laughs> You're Holy welcome. Grail. And okay. if you get the Holy Grail, you get any wish granted. Nice. So like Dragon Ball. Pretty much. Except like the focus is the Dragon Balls instead of the random. Ah! <laughs> okay. Five so it's Dragon Ball with a plot and not just people screaming. Pretty much. Okay, good. And, um, it was hilarious because every, well, like there's seven different servants. Suck. And the, the people who summon the servants, the servants are like reincarnated historic people. Okay. That fight for you. And one of them was Alexander the Great. He's like this huge buff guy. Oh, well, I mean. And, and, and he gets put with like this tiny, wimpy kid. Wimpy, wimpy, wimpy! Hefty, hefty, hefty! Yeah, oh, pretty the much. Bus! <laughs> Crazy bus. <laughs> but, Crazy um, taxi. Yes. We could play that. Yeah. I got the Dreamcast. Oh, which is the best version by far. I cut that corner too tightly. But, um... Get, 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 get out of my truck! Truck! Please! But anyways, where I was going with this was, um... So they had Alexander the Great, and he's like, Oh yeah, kid, after we get the Holy Grail, I'm gonna conquer the world again. That's uh -oh. gonna be awesome. 
and you know he's just he's talking it up and he's watching TV and he's watching the History Channel and they're talking about like tanks and stuff. He's like, I need some of those. Yeah, he does. <laughs> and the kid's like, focus on what we're doing for now. <laughs> and then he, he's watching another channel. He's like, this guy right here, he's going to be our greatest enemy. And he's pointing at the TV screen and they have an animated Bill Clinton talking. <laughs> <laughs> and he's like, this guy, he's gonna, his charisma is going to make him difficult to take down. He wasn't wrong. That's true. I like how they call that Appalachia. Just Virginia. Oh, and this, this is gonna be the final level. Nice, we've almost beaten the game. I mean, you've almost beaten the game. I just run interference. Well, yeah, but I mean. Fair enough. It's a team effort. Fair enough. Ooh, cherry trees. This is the Japan level. This is the Washington, D.C. <laughs> level. To see Washington, D.C. Yeah. Washington, dick. But, um. But yeah, it was, uh. That, that, that scene is great. I love that scene. That show is awesome too, though. Like, uh, one of the what well, one of the hero things that they brought back was um, like this. Oh, <laughs> you're welcome. He was like a French commander uh, during Joan of Arc's time, mm. and um, apparently after Joan of Arc died, he was found to be having like relationships with underage guys and stuff like that. Oh. And like he would kill them and drink their blood and stuff. Yeah, what the? And um, yeah, like, like, like that's the historical facts about him. Sure. And then in the show they made him to like this deranged psychopath, and they even paired him with a serial killer. Nice. It's so, like a serial killer accidentally summoned him, and the two of them, instead of searching for the Grail because they don't know any of that, they're just killing people. Nice. And they're just like saying how fun it is to kill people and stuff. Nice. And it's it's so great. Oh! Like, like, like when the serial killer dies too, he gets, uh, he, he gets disemboweled. <laughs> Shit. Oh no, that's not good. Uh, but, but he gets disemboweled, oh. and he's like, I never knew my organs were such a pretty color. Wow. And they, they just... Yeah, it's, it's great. So, do you see the van just upside down blocking me? Yeah, I know, the van, like, it stopped me from re-entering the racetrack. Yeah, it just did the same thing to me, but we were just far enough off that we couldn't... We were just close enough that we couldn't reset. Oh, we're driving through the Vietnam War Memorial. So let's think. What what all has changed about the world since these games came out? Because they came out in like 1996, I think. Just freaking switchbacks. Need to not exist. Um. So like, what? how different would Washington D.C. be now compared to how it's rendered in the game? Uh, potholes. Although this was probably there 20 years ago. But they have new more of them, yeah. Uh, the, I don't know, Washington DC? I don't know enough about the place. I don't either. I've never been there. Only place I've only time I've been to Washington DC I went to the Smithsonian. Which is cool, but Dude, the inside of this cave is lined with hundred dollar bills. It's a tunnel. Whatever. <laughs> it's still lined with it hundred dollar bills. That's certainly not realistic. Oh my <laughs> Do you see what I did to that purple yes. car? <laughs> the the freaking <laughs> The fire trucks are the worst. Yeah, They're they so are. huge. Cause like even if you can manage to spin out a regular sized car, it's fine. You can avoid it. Yeah, but, but the fire if you trucks. Spin out a fire and truck. the buses. Oh, we're gonna have to redo that. Yeah, one. we are. <laughs> but hey, we made it all the way to the uh, to East Coast. Yeah, we did. Who knows, it may not even be the final one. We may have to do, like, Jersey Shore or something after that. No, because you can see the map. Hmm. Yes, that's true. Why is my phone buzzing a lot? Who's messaging me? Oh, it's Kevin. Oh, what do you want? He says, WebMs have the weirdest names. Yeah, they do. I'll have to respond to him after this race. Ah! I love watching the little, uh, the little flame thing come out of our tires. Yeah. We accelerate. Or the exhaust. It's the exhaust. Thing. Oh, it's supposed to be the exhaust. Yeah. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, that's too. That's not the tires. You can see the smoke coming off the tires, but yeah, that's exhaust. Yeah, so because the fire's coming from like the same place as the smoke, so I figured, oh, hey, it's you know, there's so much friction, it's lighting the tire on. The yeah. Tire. No. But yeah, that makes me way more sense if it's coming from the exhaust. Like that? Yeah. 
I can even see that on my screen. Oh, oh no. You, why'd you ram me? I didn't. You did, though. I didn't mean to. But you did, though. <laughs> it was an accident. Hey, look, it's a Capitol building. Mike, careful. No. Oh, I figured, out, I figured no. out another thing about my car. Oh? Uh? It takes corners better than yours. Yeah, it does. Like, I can turn hella sharp. Yeah, you thing. can. Wee! Oh, no! Oh, no! What'd you do? Um, I drove out of bounds. And oh. it teleported me back yeah. out of bounds. Like, I took a... Well, like, as I was taking... How are we still 1-2 after that? Oh, because everybody else screws up at that, that S pin. Nice flips! Oh, oh, wow. You nearly punted that car into me. I got some sweet air off. Yeah, you did. I saw that. I think everyone else screwed up on that switchback as much as we did. Oh, I'm positive we did. I really hope the sounds of your shot. Oh, you bitch! <laughs> wasn't my fault. That was... <laughs> that wasn't my fault. Yeah, that was not your fault. But Still was! If you hadn't hit me the first time, I wouldn't have turned the second time. But I Blue! Get off my ass, Blue! <laughs> But I really hope the sounds of you clicking in the shoulder buttons comes through on yes. the mic. Because those are really... <laughs> I, I don't know if you guys can hear those, but those are really loud in real life. Yeah, they are. The, the GameCube have really loud shoulder buttons. They heard that. <laughs> and it's so weird. Like, every console did the uh, analog shoulder button thing differently. Yeah, they did. Except for the... Nice, first place. Nice. Except for the uh, Xbox and the Dreamcast, they did it basically the same. But the GameCubes is really different, and then the PS3, because the PS2 didn't have analog shoulder buttons, but the PS3 did theirs even weirder. Yeah, this is biased, look at that! There's like 17 races on the west, and like, nothing in the midwest, and then there's Iowa, Indiana. Just like, randomly <laughs> Iowa. Yes, player one! <laughs> Yeah. I drove across the coast in 23 minutes. Yeah, you did. You beat me by a minute and 49 seconds, or 48 seconds. Push start to join the victory celebration. All right, let's see what kind of celebration. Let's see what our reward is for cruising across the coast. Radar USA. towers. Uh, what? Why is there a tin shack? What, what, why are there cows on the White House? Yeah. Faster car reward. Oh, sick. It's blue! Next award at difficulty, difficulty yellow. yellow. Okay. Well, they're all yellow, but I mean... no, the first one was green. Are they? Yeah, because it's color scaled. Oh, I thought it was just like your no. selector. No. Hmm. Okay. Well, this shows what I know. I wasn't paying too close attention. I know. <coughs> Man, look at that! Look at that time. Yeah. That time though. All right, so that was cruising USA. You know, I would have gotten fourth best time if I, whatever. But still, that was Cruising USA. Why not, team? Uh, I think it was pretty cool. What do you think? Yeah, pretty good, except for the bullshit blue and fire trucks. <laughs> <laughs> so if you guys get a chance to play it, highly recommend you do. It's a great game. And Don't use the fry. That car was garbage. Yeah. If I did it again, I'd do a different car. Mike, Mike, look at his name. Matt Booty. <laughs> <laughs> Matt Booty. <laughs> Matt Booty. That's awesome. Uh... Beefcake boy? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> oh. oh man, the, some of these names are awesome. Yes. But yeah, definitely get this game at some point. It's it's great. If you have a ch if you have a chance and a way to play it, highly Mr. E. e. Oh, he doesn't have a picture. That's weird. no, he doesn't. He wanted to be a not fat Tony. <laughs> yeah, highly recommend this game, guys. It's it's very good. Very fun. It's it's just you know you want to pop it in for twenty minutes and race. Do that. Brian Johnson, Racy DC, or different Brian Johnson. Probably different Brian Johnson. Well, I don't know if he was credited for helping with the music. It could be him. It could be. But I don't know. It's not AC. Like this isn't ACDC stop. Oh, that's why I like this game. It's by Williams. Nice. I like pretty much every game Williams has put out. Uh, Press start. Sinistar is one of the best though. So, okay, I think that's going to be it for this episode. Hope you guys had a good time. Mike, any uh, departing words? Um, no. Okay, in that case, we will see you guys later. Oh, bye-bye. Push!